I don't have a drone or a proper drone to show the whole building, so I thought I'd go on Google Earth so you can see what the size of this place is. So what you're looking at is, it says Old Bryce's Hospital, but what it is is Jemison Center, which was built in the 1920s as a part of Bryce's Hospital, which opened in Tuscaloosa as Alabama State Hospital for the Insane. But a lot of people call it Old Bryce's Hospital. It's not Old Bryce's Hospital. It's Jemison Center. It had different names along the way, mainly three, but those are the two that are really people, well the main one that people talk about or say is Old Bryce's Hospital. Anyways, I want you to have a closer look at this place so you can see what I mean, how big it is. It has a total of three stories. As you can tell, it's been abandoned for a very long, long time. The other information I digged up says it was built in 1939, opened in 1939, lasted 80 years, and closed in 1977, has yet to been demolished and has been decaying for 42 years. It says last known status is abandoned. So it's either 1920s or it was a 1939. That's what this thing is. And to think, if you see what my curse, well, if you think about it, the columns right here, you'd be like a little per, you'd be like a size of an ant if you looked at it in person versus these columns. Other than that, there's not really much information uh, on this place. It's very, very little. The thing I want to know is how many rooms are in this the place. I saw something that said 296, so maybe around three. I mean, 286, so it has to be around 300 rooms. Like I said, there I don't. There's not much information on this. It's just what I read up online. Give you a better view of the hospital from this side. Just look at that. And then there's something in the back, which I can't... Oh, yeah, it's like a little garage and whatnot, which you'll see later on in the video what it is. So here you go. It's a side view of the place. It kind of reminds me of the letter E, if you look at it, just the shape of it. Let's move on to the next thing that I want to say. So the Bryce's Hospital is right here, where you can see on the right-hand side. And there's this little bitty house, which we went... Me and Lycan Films went inside but we're unsure what it was used for but it's kinda of strange to think why would there be a little house next to a hospital on the right hand side which if you go downwards you see this other building which we explored it it had we don't know exactly what it was used for besides hospital the thing I know about this little building that you're looking right straight in front of you is it had to be a part of the hospital it was, I don't know exactly what it was all used for because there's no information on this little bitty area but when I explored it, it looked like it had to be a little offices area, maybe extra rooms, something I forgot to mention. It was also overcrowded. Maybe that's why they had the little rooms or this extra building. Who knows? You'll see later on in the video. I hope you enjoyed this little history. It wasn't much, if that makes sense. Let's get right into the video and tell me what you guys think about it. Is that what I think it is? This hospital is actually the first one I've ever gone to that's this big. I've never seen anything like this. The other ones that I've done are pretty small, but this one is massive. And there's also more back to that direction, which will go there sooner or later. But for now, we're going to start up in this little area, see what we can find, because this is amazing. You can tell kids have already been here if you look at the tree. If you look upwards, you see that there's the columns. It's missing the top part of the roof. Alright, let's head into this spooky place, boy. Jeez, I don't know where to begin. I got stairs there. It looks like there's some stairs over here as well. Holy crap, this place is huge. 
Wow. Okay, so look at the ground. Oh, look at this. Look in front of you, there's a wire on the windows. I'm trying to keep people out. And there's even more stairs. What the heck? Hmm. Wow. Let's go check outside. And here, just have a look. So there must be three stories to this place. Holy crap, I really do not like this ground. It can't get any colder, can it? Hmm. Watch your step up here. Oh, I see it. And you got three places to go straight down to another level. So here's a view. There's a garage right there. I'm gonna show you something. It brings you back down. I don't think that'd be a pleasant drop. Got one here, one there, and one over there. See, that's what happens when you don't pay attention. You see these, you'll fall. One side of the tub, but not this side. <laughs> and here, oh. Talk about this one? Yeah. So oh, I see. see it. Out see something, wow. Jeez. There's water damage right there. I just realized because I heard I heard drips. Oh, there it is, right there. So my camera died, or the battery died on it. I'm gonna use my phone for the time being until we get to the next location. That way I can get my battery out of the car because I don't want to go back. So let's see if we can head to the next floor. There's nothing really in here, honestly. It's just a lot of damage, so let's go up. Oh, gee. Look at these stairs. Straight up sketchy. Straight up. Yo. That's a long way down. And that's the other side of the roof, which I don't think I'm going to be able to get there.
Look at this tree. Gee. And out toward that way, apparently, is an airport. There's the top of the pillars. Look closely right here. Just look closely. <laughs> it's a doorway. The only thing that's left is the frame. The walls on each side have been knocked out. This is the most destroyed hospital I have ever seen. It goes to show how much kids really care about a place once it's abandoned. And to think there used to be a wall right here, because there's a staircase that leads down to another staircase. Here's the top of the pillars that I wanted to get to. Oh boy, woo! So we can go from here all the way down, boy. Finally, we get good graffiti for once. And yes, what I thought. Pretty much, this is what I'm standing on, which it may collapse, so we gotta be careful. Really careful on this place. Well, this hospital, or. Bryce's hospital, I guess we'll put it. There's not really much to show, to be honest. Because look, it's... It's destroyed. Like, I honestly don't know what the heck to show, really, in this place. It's it's kind of depressing, honestly. I mean, it's a good find still, but it's just... It's kind of depressing. Like, let me turn you around. Now you can get a better view of what I'm talking about. That is still attached is that light right there oh well that's interesting all right as I'm getting ready to leave we got mattresses in here it can only mean one thing actually homeless people are probably still sleeping here one of them's buried into the ground So there's three of these little buildings, which I'm guessing either they were, actually to be honest, I don't know what they are, but let's go check out one of them at least, see what the heck is in here. I'm guessing it's got to be a part of the uh, hospital we just went into. Oh god, is that what I think it is? And there's candles there too. Oh jeez. What the heck is this? At least we have that in there. It makes me feel a little bit better. Ooh, let's have a little look in here. I think this is actually the bathroom. I think somebody may be sleeping here. 
Okay, so this must be connected all together, which makes sense now. Because that way goes that way. So yes, it's all connected together, apparently. This is all connected together, pretty much. Yeah. That's what it is. Holy crap. Actually, let's go have a little look right here. I want to see what's going good, 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 good going. Okay, that's the office that we just uh, saw. <laughs> Why use a door when you got two ways to go out? <laughs> let's use the door anyways. It works. Look at that. That is really cool. Like I said, what's up, what's up with the doors? Like, look at this. And look at this. <laughs> this is too funny. I'm serious. I don't know why, but this is it's too much for me. Whoa. That's a spooky hallway. Let's go this way. Just because I see a cute puppy in front of me. That's who that little puppy is. That's Courage the Cowley Dog. So that's who that little puppy is right here. There's two of them. Hi, Courage. Nice to see you at an abandoned hospital. Or whatever the heck this may have been. Right as I was about to leave, there's a couch. I mean, it kind of did look good at one point. Maybe a year ago, who knows. That top part still looks pretty good. Looks brand new a little bit. That is very spooky. Very, very spooky. look down here there's a lot of water that brings you to the basement I bet you that's where they had the morgue and everything let's climb it I can't see well, but there's a toilet right there with my fingers pointing. That's really cool. And obviously I can't go any higher. I think I found out where they burn the bodies. Does that look like one of those things that they burn the bodies in? Cremate them? I might be wrong, but I think that's what it is. Okay to sit on? Yeah, you know, I'm definitely gonna wash these clothes as soon as I get home. Yeah, <laughs> I would too. Jeez, <laughs> that is hilarious though. <laughs>